In this video, you will learn how to insert citations and references in Microsoft Word. I will use the APA style guidelines during this tutorial. I am Dr. Tahir Mahmood and you are watching Teaching Junction channel. Firstly, open your Word document where you want to insert citation as well as references. I have opened a Word document and it is a scientific report. And firstly, I will demonstrate how to insert in-text citations. And in later part of video, I will demonstrate how to uh, use the references option of Microsoft Word to insert the reference list in your document. So let's start this tutorial. Firstly, make sure you have opened your Word document and place your cursor where you want to insert a citation. For example, I want to insert a citation at the end of this sentence. Give a space and go to this reference option. Remember that we will not use any reference management software. We will use the now uh, inbuilt uh, reference tools of Microsoft Word. When you click on this reference tab, you will find the option of citation and bibliography. And from here, you can see there is the option for style. Select your style. For example, currently we are using the APA style. So I will use this APA 6th edition style. I have clicked on it. Next, you will find the option of insert citation. Click on this down arrow and if you have already entered data about uh, references you will find here and if you are using first time then you will you did not find this option instead of this you find only this option add new source and click on it for example I want to add a new source I will click on it and it will ask you different information if you click here you will find different option for example, you want to write the reference of either book or book section, general article and so many options are there. Firstly, uh, for example, I want to write a reference of a report. You can see here bibliography fields appeared here according to the type of source. If you have selected general article, then the bibliography field will be different. If you have selected uh, book chapter, then the bibliography field will be different. So in case of report, you can see here uh, different bibliography field. I will fill them. Firstly, name of author. For example, I James Doe. Next is the title. I write how to write. Bibliographies. Remember that these are imaginary information. I just want to, uh, for demonstration purpose, I am using this information. These are not actual information. Publisher, adventure work, CD Chicago. Now, if you want to enter more, more information, for example, you have more information about report which you want to mention in your reference list, then you can click on this show all bibliography fields and you will find other uh, different bibliography fields. You can fill according to your convenience. And I will only use this existing information. So I will click on OK. Now you can see here the reference inserted here. Next, if I want to insert this same reference here, you don't need to enter all information again. Just go to insert citation option and find that references here. That is the reference which we have recently inserted. Click here and you can see here the in-text citation appeared here. You can uh, similarly select here, go to this option and just click on this reference and your in-text citation appeared here. Now, uh, if I want to enter the reference uh, in-text citation here and uh, I don't have uh, currently information about that references, I want to enter this information in future. 
so there is a useful option of placeholder click here and you can uh, insert many placeholder and you can change your name placeholder one two three four currently it is placeholder two that's fine click on okay now you can see here that placeholder option appeared here now if you want to edit this citation for example you have uh, sometime you have entered the wrong information and you want to edit this one just click on it and here you will find the option of uh, citation option uh, in the form of down arrow click on it you will find two option firstly edit citation and second one edit source firstly we will edit citation click on it you can enter the page number for example i want to mention page number 1110 click ok you can see here page number appeared along with the, this reference secondly if you want to edit source click here and you can edit the all information for example i want to change the year to 2008 click ok Uh, another option appear this source exists in your master list and current document do you want to update both list with these changes click yes and you can see here that the information is updated now the year is 2008 instead of 2006 and additionally you can also see uh, it also updated other information as well similarly there is another useful option which is the manage sources click here and whichever reference you want to edit select this ref that reference and go to edit option and from here you can edit that references and that will be updated according to your interdata here is the option of current list and the check mark shows that these references are all already used in this document now if you get the information of uh, this placeholder for example you don't know uh, that information and you have got that information and you want to enter that information simply go to here go to edit source option for example that was the reference of a i will enter website then uh, fill these bibliography fields author is jackie chan You can mention the name of web page, web page. Name of website. For example, I want to mention this one. Year, month, day and URL. Now I have entered that information, I will click on OK. Now you can see here the uh, citation is updated according to our entered information. And now I will demonstrate how you can insert two to three reference at the same place simultaneously. For example, here I want to insert two references. I will use already entered information. For example, I want to insert this in, uh, references here click here 
you can see here uh, in text citation appeared here I want to insert another reference here for example this one uh, sorry place your cursor within that references and again go to insert citation and click here now you can see here there are two in text citation firstly Ali uh, here then the second in text citation here if you want to add another uh, in text citation simply click here go to insert citation option and select that citation you can see here now three in text citation appeared here within this same parenthesis and these are separated with these column semicolons now you have learned the in text citation now we will move to next section which is the uh, insertion of the reference list firstly make sure you have entered the reference in a new page click here I, uh, another option is you can insert page break go to this bibliography section when you enter uh, bibliography section you will find different option for example you want to ins insert bibliography list or references or work cited I will select references now you can see here the all the references which you have inserted in this document appear at the end of this document and you don't need to write these information manually select this one you can even edit this for example I want to edit this go to home I want to change its color to black and change its font size to time new romans and 12 select center align in APA 7th the reference should be bold and in APA 6 this should appear without bold you can do according to your convenience secondly select these references you can according to APA style guidelines now this should be double space I will select double space now you can see here we have completed the formatting of this uh, references I will also insert a double space secondly you can click on this option and insert don't add space between paragraph of the same style click ok now uh, if you want to change your font size or any other information you can do that according to your requirement so that's the end of this tutorial if this tutorial is helpful for you then please like this video and subscribe our channel for more informative video that's the end of this tutorial. Goodbye.